talk to T. Uh-uh. Nuh-uh. Hey, you want to be aliens, leave my friend alone. She's the only one who sees through me and sticks around. You bit me! It's dead. Now it's a stain. <laughs> we can't do this, Dad's a wizard bug. No, 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 it's okay. When you show people something completely crazy, they try to make sense of it. Hey, everybody! It's an alien from the Guaga Galaxy! Like that. Man, being old is hard. Let me tell you, when I get old, I'm just gonna sit around and read magazines. That's what you do anyway. I'm practicing for later. We're in the face of an emergency, and you're kicking back reading a magazine. Flipping through a magazine is how I come up with my lies. I've got it. You do? I know how Jennifer can get Brad back. Wow. Uh, well, here, I'll hold this. You don't want to have this while you're talking to her. Oh, thanks. Oh, looks like I got me some lunch. Okay, you can't create life from from old socks, eggshells, pizza crusts, and grandma's wig. How does it say that? Creating life is not that simple. Where does it say that? You have no idea what you're talking about. Where does it say that? Wow. You have no idea. <laughs> Sorry, I had to stop this nerd on weird violence. <laughs> And there are no evil queens in Jim Bob's world. There's always an evil queen. Sometimes she's the head cheerleader, sometimes she's the fairy tale stepmother, and sometimes she's your sister. Alex, can I talk to you out on the terrace, please? Well, that's weird, so yeah. That was weird. Hold for Friday's lessons. Don't touch it, Alex. Hmm. I don't remember where this was hanging, so I don't know what not to touch. Alex is so good to us. I don't have to make a fuss. Everyone is on the bus, because Alex is a genius. I approve of the message, so I'm going to ignore the delivery. Come on, Mira Harper, go. At least I know I can always count on you to agree with me. Woo! Go Team Alex! Whoa. That was weird. Well, you know what I say. When it's weird, you gotta go into it. Card Max, distract the chicken. Do your distract the chicken dance. I thought you'd never ask. Hey, look, sometimes you just gotta yank the bandage right off. That's what I did with Mason. It was hard, but I'm ready for my next relationship now. And I know when it happens, we're gonna be together forever. But I've gotten used to it, and so should you, because Juliet is not coming back. Or is she? No, she's not. Didn't you see her hobble off into the woods? I think Mason ate her. Do what I do when people ask me for answers I don't know. Just say random words until they change the subject. Are you sure that's gonna work? Lollipop. All right, can't get any more random than that. Cream cheese. You just did. Oh, it totally works. Okay. I'm going back in. What is going on in here? If you would have told me that my birthday reunion with Ernesto was gonna be a three-ring dance party, chicken squawking, elf circus, I would have said, ah, oh, no thanks. Sorry, Mom, I didn't mean for all of this to happen. You never mean it, do you, Alex? Yet it always happens. I should have known better than to trust you. Um, I know how much that you've sacrificed for us, and I just wanted to give you a special birthday with Uncle Ernesto, and then Uncle Kelbo sent a magic chicken that tells the future. It was just 
too tempting. Yeah. Magic is always too tempting for you, isn't it? And now I had to lie to my own brother about what's going on in there, which is exactly what I was trying to avoid in the first place. I'm sorry, Mom. <laughs> this is not a good design. <laughs> yeah, it's not. You know Alex made that. Bravo! Bravo! the best backpack shirt ever. <laughs> Harper, help him down. Justin, are you ready to trip him? Giving up your portal is an enormous sacrifice, Alex. Are you sure you won't ever regret this? Regret is for the weak. That's my Alex. Lovely and scary. Well, you know, it would be fun to go to a party, Alex. I mean, I'd love to meet your friends, mingle, get to know... Oh, I don't have any friends. <laughs> I'm your friend, and I want you to go. You yeah, see? Your only friend wants you to go. Now I'm beginning to understand why Justin has robot friends. Okay, Alex. We know you're the brains of the Russo operation. <laughs> oh, flattery. The first step in basic interrogation, why don't you try something else new? <laughs> <laughs> Are you hungry? Maybe you'd like a hamburger. Go ahead. Have some. See, we're all friends here. <laughs> so, is everyone in your family a wizard? You skipped a bunch of questions. Excuse me for trying to keep it fresh. <laughs> Man, this little lady can eat. Okay, you've eaten. Now tell us, is everyone in your family a wizard? the maps up and go mingle. Uh, how about we keep the maps up and mingle, okay? <laughs> hey, how's it going? Pretty good. I heard there's this crazy hairy kid at the party. I came as soon as I got the text. Where? I've got to see this. He's talking about you. Why did you put your map down? I get it, Alex. You're worried about what other people think of the way I look. Uh, uh, what? No, who? You mean them? Oh my gosh, everybody sees us. You're ashamed of me, aren't you? No. I... I don't know. Maybe. It's just... that you have hair on your forehead. And you walk in a circle, like, ten times before you sit. I'm sorry you feel that way. I guess I'll leave you alone so I won't have to embarrass you anymore. Oh, I couldn't help it. People were pointing and laughing. But Alex, what I've always loved about you is that you don't care what other people think. I can't even do that. My boyfriend was embarrassing me, so I kissed him so he'd pass out. But it's better than that. That's why we're such good friends. I mean, it doesn't matter how over the top I am. You never made me feel weird about it once. Even when I had that cupcake hat. I mean, it was a cupcake on my head. How could you not comment on that? <laughs> Harper, I put up with that because you put up with me. I think it's a fair trade. Well, it seems like Mason's having to put up with something right now. You've already lost him once. Don't let a little thing like you have to brush his face make you lose him again. <laughs> Thank you, Harper. You're welcome. I don't have my wand, but I want to keep this dramatic moment, so I'm just going to use my hand. Okay. <laughs> Mason, I need to talk to you. Oh, you sure? The doorman might see us together. Please, I'm sorry. I was completely wrong to act that way. What we have is so much stronger than any of that superficial stuff. The most important thing to me is that you're back and we're together. 
I love you, no matter what. I don't know if I can believe you. Then let me prove it. How? The same way people have been doing it for centuries now. By slow dancing to a romantic pop song. <laughs>